Hello and welcome to Antique.com Today's video is about the Compaq Presario CDS520 the 486 all-in-one computer from 1994. This model came with a quad-speed CD-ROM drive. The CPU is a DX266 from Intel and it has 4 meg of onboard RAM. Let's first start by looking inside the computer. At the back are two little thumb screws that you can unscrew and pull the motherboard out. The motherboard comes with 4 meg of onboard RAM. It's been updated with two 16 meg SIMs, giving a total of 36 meg. The CPU is a DX266 and that's under the heatsink. The BIOS battery is dead, but there are jumpers on the motherboard to allow an external battery box, so that's what I've used to act as the BIOS charge. On the other side, we see a riser with two ISA 16-bit slots. We can just make out the ESS sound card chip. To get access to the hard drive and CD-ROM, the front of the case comes off, with two small screws underneath and a couple of clips. Two further screws enable us to withdraw the CD-ROM and hard drive carriage. On this machine, I've replaced the hard drive with a 4 gig flash drive, although it's only formatted for 2 gig as that's the limit for DOS. The original hard drive was a 420 meg Kona hard drive. I've replaced this even though it's working because it's incredibly noisy and has some bad sectors. So let's get it booted up. I'm sure many of you remember the beeps and clicks and whirs when these machines first started up floppy drive engaging, hard drive spinning up. It does take a bit of time, but you know, these machines are quite old now. And here we are into Windows, Windows for Work Groups 3.11, for those that can remember it. Don't worry about what appears to be a flicker on the screen. That's just the synchronization between this camera and the screen. In reality, it's nice and clear. So now the basic machine is all up and running, it's time for me to start installing the games. Mainly Doom, Command and Conquer, SimCity and maybe even Descent. So once I get all those installed, I'll do another video where I'll show you the games themselves. In the meantime, thanks for watching and if you really like this, you know which button to press.